assumptions for binary logistic regression binary logistic regression is a statistical method or techniques that examines if there is association or relationship or link between two variables one of the variable is called the outcome and the other variable is called predictor or predictors the outcome or the dependent variable or alternatively called the response uh, variable have to be binary to perform binary logistic regression one of the assumptions the criteria is that the uh, outcome is binary so what is a binary variable or outcome a binary variable is a variable with only two categories in it such as having heart diseases no heart diseases diabetes no diabetes so it is a nominal uh, variable it is categorical variable with only two categories in it on the other hand the predictor or predictors can be either a continuous variable that is measured at a interval or ratio level or it can be a binary uh, variable which have on it two categories or it can be categorical or multinomial or nominal uh, variable which has more than two categories in it and finally the predictor can be ordinal ordinal uh, variable is a variable with categories but these categories have order in it such as uh, age classes so to perform binary logistic regression you have to have uh, an outcome that is binary and one predictor or more than one predictor uh, or predictors and these predictors can be either continuous binary categorical or ordinal so what are assumptions assumptions are certain or specific conditions or requirement or criteria that must be met prior to performing any statistical test these criteria and requirement about the data so it has to be met before performing any statistical test to generate a valid and credible and reliable results any violation of these assumptions can lead to unreliable results can cause incorrect conclusion end up with the wrong conclusion based on the wrong uh, output based on the wrong uh, results from a test that the data should not be used for that test at as there was a violation of these assumptions so for binary logistic regression to perform binary logistic regression six major assumptions have to be fulfilled or met prior to do the test the first assumption is that the outcome variable is binary the outcome which is can be called dependent variable response variable or outcome variable have to be binary binary means it's binomial binomial means have two categories so this test binary logistic regression is for the outcome for a data that have an outcome in it the outcome is uh, categorical only have two categories in it so it is binary the second assumption is the independence of observations independence of observations means that the outcome for one observation does not affect or depend on the outcome of another in another way observations do not come from repeated measurement of the same individual i.e. observations 
are not related to each other in any way. The third assumption is that linearity of the logged for predictors. What does that mean? Linearity of the log Odds, it means that there is a linear relationship between the log odds of the outcome variable and the predictor variables. How can we check linearity? By doing the box Tidwell test, by drawing scatter plots of continuous predictors against log value. The fourth assumption is that there is no multicollinearity. So what does multicollinearity mean? It means that there is a correlation between the predictor variable. So for no multicollinearity, the correlation between the predictor variable in the regression model should not be high. How do we check uh, multicollinearity by using the variance inflation factor abbreviated as VIF. The fifth assumption is that there is no outliers. What is an outlier? An outlier is an extreme high or low values within the data. So no strong outliers or influential point. These outliers are extreme values in the predictor which can distort the result. How do we test for outliers? By calculating the Cook's distance for each observation. The sixth assumption is that the sample size has to be large. Large sample size provides stable and reliable estimates. For binary logistic regression does not require errors to be normally distributed or homoscedastic since the outcome is binary. So since the outcome is binary and this is different from uh, linear uh, regression or multiple linear regression, this is a binary. There is no need for uh, error independence and homoscasticity. If you find this video useful, do subscribe to the channel, leave any comment in the indicated uh, box and activate the notification bell to receive the recent and uh, latest release uh, into the channel of several different video clip and click on the like icon and share the video link with others so the channel can expand and improve to include a large scope of different statistical method and how to analyze data using uh, several different uh, statistical packages such as SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistic, or Statistics, Graph, Pad, Prism, G Power, Python, and RevMan. If you are a student or a researcher and you have a data, whether it is um, um, quantitative all qualitative and you want to perform a statistical uh, analysis on that data using any of the softwares listed here whether it's SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistics, Graphpad, Prism, Revman, GMP, Python then do contact me to arrange for either a one-to-one -one private tutor session or a training course uh, on any of these uh, statistical packages. My contact details are given here. So don't hesitate to uh, write to me or email me if you need uh, a private one-to-one uh, -one, uh, tutoring or a training course.